Now, thankfully, those storms rolled out of our area just in time for the Virginia 10 miler this morning. This race is a staple for the Lynchburg community, but this year it was extra special. We'll take you inside all of the fun during the 50th anniversary. A historic horn signaling the start of the 50th year of the Virginia 10 miler. I'm excited because I'm up in here. Thousands packed the streets of Lynchburg Saturday morning ready to race. This was a first for some participants. One of my coworkers at work has talked about the 10 miler since I started working there. She tried to talk me to it last year and I didn't agree, but now here I am to do it. But others, like Liz Alcock, are seasoned pros. Well, back in 1974, I remember being here and getting uh, really wanting to do it. And I think 76 was my first race. Some people say this run was a fun way to let loose and enjoy time together. I'm in the Army, so I run quite a bit for my job. So this is kind of an opportunity for us to do something together. Uh, with both of us kind of being really busy, this is kind of our dedicated date time. Others, like Lynchburg Police Chief Ryan Zudema, who's part of the color guard during the race, says it has a deeper meaning. My hope is that it reminds uh, our community of the sacrifices that the men and women in our military make every day for us. Uh, a lot of times it's out of sight, out of mind, and so hopefully uh, as they see the, the core of uh, flags come through, they, they kind of take a second to pause and remember. Whether you ran it voluntarily or maybe you ran it against your will, you can now smile and say, I'm part of a 50-year legacy in Lynchburg.